it, it is this operation. But <laughs> just go wide enough to get it all so that I get it in. No, they haven't filled it up quite, but however, there's enough there to, to, to show us. Smells good. We've got some of the resin that they use for protection in the corner. Typical honey pots. But you can see the number of bees that are in there when it comes to honey harvest time. That bit comes off e easily. Lock those up. Uh, whoops, sorry. That would be smarter. <laughs> There'll be a, a few losses, but yeah. Now, there are going to be losses, but I can't avoid that. This will be the highest loss I've had. When you say loss, is that because these are inside bees? Uh, well, there's pretty much no way of getting the bees to f find their way home. Yeah. Okay. It's just part of the cost of when I tried this last time, I had no way of holding this and lifting that up. And that is the sum total of it. Oh, 15 minutes maybe. Uh, the when they are more disturbed than normal, I wonder whether. See, what I normally do with, with this is I do it beside the hive. Uh, and that and that is way better for the bees. Uh, but I, I I I had to venture out to uh, to try to try it in this sort of demonstration situation. What I wasn't prepared to do was do, do it inside. <laughs> and what do you do once the honey's drained? Pop? Pardon? What do you do with the honey once it's drained into the base? No, I didn't bring that bit up. Oh. You can actually just press that. But I've managed at, in the Petrie area, which is, I, my son lives at Petrie, uh, and I've been experimenting, really just trying to get this honey system worked out a bit better. I've tried foundation. It is a, I can tell you, it's a very fancy foundation. Uh, I make a foundation that gets the bees to produce honey pots like that in a nice flat row, in, in lines. Uh, I dip mould it in their own, own wax. I collect wax from the solar wax extractor. Uh, I think they're. And, but when you give them wax to work with, they tend to want to put And the fitting in the bottom clamp down. It's not just floating. How often do you uh, do this? Pardon? How often do you do this? Once a year? Oh, once a year. When it's full. Uh, 
the, what that is stuck into is this hard stuff here. Uh, and see, this box is unusual in that it's deep. Uh, most honey supers, or this, this, this honey, uh, um, My card. That'd be good. The honey has got thicker, got colder. Mm. I was hoping for some sun to make this hot. Mm. He's saying that's our honey.